the plays, uh, tutorials. Today we're going to be showing you how, I'm going to show you how to make every, how to make specific rooms for your Animal Crossing, uh, built. So, I'm going to get this loaded up real quick, and I'll get my green guy away from YouTube. What's up, YouTube? In this video, I'll be showing you how to make different rooms in for your houses in Minecraft. All the rooms will be showing you, I'll be showing you. You can make for each room. So we're gonna be doing a kitchen, or a bathroom, a kitchen, a bedroom. A dining room, a living room, and a rec room. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and get this out of the way here. So we're going to need block of quartz, I'm gonna use black and white concrete. I'm going to make kind of a tile kind of floor for this. We're going to need levers. We're going to need oak trap door or iron trap door. That's what we prefer. But I prefer oak because it'll be easier. Um, we're going to use Bert's door and a, oh, a cauldron. If we can find it here, there we go. A button. And any type of glazed terracotta. I'm going to use white glazed terracotta. And, uh, um, any type of banner. I'm going to use white. And, uh, I think that does it actually. Oh, and uh, put my hook. If I can find it. There it is. Okay, first thing we're going to do is we're going to lay a bit of wall. By the way, this is a 7x7. Seven seven. But the reason why we're doing, we're doing the outside real quick is because I want to show you guys the kind of layout. And of course, uh, tell you what you can do to make it. Oh, and we might need a, but I'll do that when we get done. But the reason why we're using, uh, quartz block. Is because it looks more white, and that's what we want. But anyway, we're going to do it up by five. Now, in the middle of all of it is going to be a door. I see. Not there. And once we get inside,
replace all these with black tile or black uh, concrete. And with whoops, white concrete. To make kind of a tile effect, need some kind of uh, carpet and I'll show you what we're going to do with that. Yeah, it's just meant, cause we're going to make like a rug. Alright. There's a tile. Okay. So, I'm gonna right here, place one, two, three, four, five tiles. We have five white glazed dark out, and then one, two, three in front of it. Let's see. two buttons and a trip by hook they say horse block and sub and a old trap door toilet over here place a cauldron like concrete Oop. buttons kind of looks like doors and a, t a hook on top of there to make like a sink And that for a towel. And there is your bathroom. Now, um, we might make a bastard bedroom of it, like pretty soon. But I'll show you how to do that in a little bit, and uh, I'll show you how to make it. And, uh, oh. let's make a master bathroom, too. If you want to set some light on this place, you can place. I'll get rid of that. Let's put down with that. A redstone lamp and a lever. Perfect. Top 
couple of them in here will light up. By the way, the levers, I mean the buttons, along with the tripwire hook, kind of looks like a faucet. Alright. And there is your bathroom. I'm going to move out now. Okay. Next up is our kitchen. So, I'm going to grab some more items here again. And we're going to use that again. Uh, we're going to use... I might use block of iron for this. Yeah, that's what we use. We'll use a furnace. Blast furnace will work too. Uh, we're going to use... We're going to use a door. We're going to make like a fridge. We'll make that an iron door. Uh, we're going to use make a sink and some cabinets. So the cabinets are going to be made out of oak wood, uh, oak wood fence. I'm going to use a cauldron yet again. Alright. So, again, like I did before, we get a little room here. And you know, you guys could actually, uh, kind of make the wounds bigger if you want. But these will uh, fit your Animal Crossing house. Quite well. This white an iron floor here. Kind of makes it like a tiled floor in here. There we go. Again, keys, whatever you want. Perfect. Okay. Over here on the left, we're going to make... Oh. A stove. I need to also gotta get some uh, quartz stairs. Of these, place two quartz stairs to the right, 
Yeah, you block quartz. With one, two, three. Yeah, I think that's enough. And then place two right next to it and down. And then place. Now, you can do this and not place anything inside. Or, we can place that, open it, or, to make it a little deeper, a little bigger, and you can place a test or soaker box inside. I'm going to use a test to show you what it would look like. And lever. Perfect. All right. To the left, go to place if I can. Is that even going to work? cabinet. I'm going to place another. If you want. Over here. Block quartz. Right next to each other. That. Place that. There is your kitchen. Now, if you want, place more. Cabinets all the way around. And, if you want, place one. Whoops. Down here as well. However, I would suggest if you do that to place some liquid slabs on top to make it look like a cabinet. Perfect. And that, that could be like a little cutting board thing. And if you want, you can place a stone plaster plate on top. Is your kitchen done? I'm gonna toss these away. I 
By the way, all the uh, ideas are going to be... Up to you. Alright, as always. Now, if you want, you can make it a little higher. These are just prototypes. Perfect. All right. Now I'm gonna do the bedroom. We're gonna make, and I'll go make another one. This guy show you. That's gonna be a little bigger. This guy show you what a master bedroom will look like. Please, old door. God, I think it looks like a kitty bedroom. Bookshelves. Uh, the beds. These red beds. We might use ladders. We'll use. Does it? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oak. Buttons. And there we go. So. Just keep in mind the rooms are about the same height. Again, if you feel a little cramped, you can repeat, can make it higher. And I think I'm gonna make this one higher because it goes to how to make a double decker bed. In order to do that, we need to have it a little higher. Oh. We in rod. And we place terracotta. Or what's that terracotta you want to use? But place terracotta kind of to me looks like a lampshade. Now, like I said before, we're making these house. We're making the big house. You don't really have to uh, make a door, but this is just so you what it will look like with a door. Please wait on the inside. All right. Is that quartz block? I don't know. Eh, we're going to use... I'm going 
is a block. Okay, so over here, we're gonna place two oak wood, a couple of buttons to make whoop, like a drawer, and a an end rod with a red place terracotta. Looks kind of look like a uh, lampstand. Uh, over here, we can place a bed, or if you prefer, and to kind of do this, we have to place it on top. You can make this bed a double, a, a double bed. If you prefer. Perfect. Actually, it doesn't look that bad. Actually. So we'll put, keep it like that. And then over here, I'm going to place one, two, three. Actually, two. Two. Oh. Uh, these. Place that. And these. This is like a dresser. I think there's anything else I'm missing. Oh! And if you want to make a toy chest, if there's like a child's bedroom, very simple. Oh. There. Perfect. And there's your bedroom. Okay. Next up is a dining room. We're not going to get rid of this. We are going to get rid of these. Um, grab out wood stairs. Uh, block quartz. Clouds. Flower pots. Can't see if I cups. 
Um, hmm. Oh, I have block quartz. That's right. So, put some plates. Sigma five plates. a china cabinet can I show you that we can actually do that I might make this one quartz oh and we need some kind of lighting oh it's gonna be very very dark If you want, you can make this, make a, make it into glowstone, or uh, sea lanterns. But if you do that, it'll look kind of weird, because it'll be poking out on the top. So I would suggest going with the. Uh, Try the true method of just using a lantern. Or, if you prefer, you can still use that whole end rod with a red glazed terracotta. By the way, Like I said, this is a prototype, so no matter how you make it, doesn't really matter. Okay, so over here we're going to make like a time a cabinet. One, two, three. One, two, one, two. Actually, no, but if you want, you can. So, over here, we're going to place a an upside down open stair. Place two of those. Place another upside down open stair. Like so. And place Actually we'll make it this big. And then we'll place a couple of Uh, oak wood stairs for tears. Place some flower pots around. Stone pressure plates for plates. Now you don't have to make it this small, but again, this is more or less just a prototype kind of thing to show you. What you can do to make it. You know what?
Let's show you how to make a little um, Alright Inside You can place that And there is your uh, Little Um Turn a cabinet. Alright. We're moving on to the living room. Our courts. Oakwood stairs. An Oakwood. Yeah, Oakwood stairs. I might make this a little bigger. To kind of show you what you can do. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Here by nine, nine by nine. Now we're gonna grab some. Grab a end rod. With the red glazed terracotta. And we'll make this jungle door. And a nope slab. Okay. Let's go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And this will show you what kind of size you can have for each room. <laughs> but keep in mind, you can only have a bit as big of a room only, only if. You made your house big enough. If you have not, then that's okay too. Behind here, we're gonna make. Oh, and we also need some red concrete.
All right, so behind here, place one, two, three, four, five. Red concrete. Place three in the middle. Two on each end. Kind of looks like a sofa. Actually, let's not do it like that. Let's make it this big. There you go. There's your sofa. In front of it, we're going to place an upside down upward stair and one right next to it. Like so. Like concrete. See, make it about that big. There we go. anyone actually think so <coughs> let's see picks on the front no blocks on the left and the right Like a TV. And we'll also make a little fireplace. I'll just dump those out. And big blocks. And that wreck. Oh, and uh, if you want to get even. Uh, these to make a make the floor. <laughs> I almost forgot about that. this white concrete Right here we're going to place this netherrack. Netherrack, netherrack. Alright. And then Get out our uh, 
flint. Let me go find it. Damn it. Not what I wanted to do. F. L. I. Grab out our end rod with the red glazed terracotta. Put some lamps around the place. Oh, and uh, iron bars. That looks like a fireplace. Nice, cozy fireplace. And it actually helps light up the uh, room. A little bit. In my opinion. back out here. I'm going to grab these. Grab these. We're going to make ourselves a little um Den slash rec room. <sighs> and then we'll do a master bedroom slash bathroom. Got some anvils. Some. We need carpet. Just to show you what we can do, we'll just use these as preferences. Quick. Any kind of stair you can want to use, you can use. Any kind of slab you can use. Um. A black banner. Awkward planks and awkward signs. But we do need awkward planks. And uh, else. Oh, we 
also want to make a little mini fridge. We'll use white soaker boxes for that. And I think that does it. Um, I think. Anyway. What's... Alright. Oh, and, uh... Again. This. And a red... Place terracotta. Alright. First we're going to do is uh, kind of lay out the room. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's make it eleven. Then eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And the den floor can be whatever you want to make it. Oakwood stairs. Oakwood. Alright, so. I'm going to get rid of these. Of these. And we'll uh, place this here. Alright. So, we're going to make a pool table. No place an anvil here, two anvil here, anvil here, an anvil here. I might make this room a little bigger though. And what crowds? figure out how to do this something like that as a pull table over here we'll place it upside down 
can see. Then upside down one there, right side up one there. Then, boom. Place as many of those as you want. Those are arcade machines. There. Oh, damn it. Okay, and we're going to make like a little light that's going to come down on the top to kind of make like a big it's gonna be like one of those lights that comes down onto a little place Place it there. Perfect. Kind of thing like that. As a, uh... And if you want, you can place a low recliner. But that is up to you, and we're going to, I'll show you how to do that. So here, you're going to place one, two. Kind of think of that like a recliner. And perfect. Alright. There's your uh, back room. Or your uh, den. That, by the way, can be placed anywhere in the house. Oops. Perfect. And we'll place one more right over here. Oh, and if you want, place a little mini feds over here. Okay, now I'm going to show you one last build, and that is the uh, master bedroom. It's even going to have a bath, room right next to it. So we're going to need.
If you want, you can place a TV in here too. That's up to you. And I'm going to do that, that too. All you're going to do is use the same thing we did in the uh, living room. Except we're gonna make this a flat screen TV. Perfect. Alright. Place a Yeah, we'll do that. For a nightstand. Perfect. No. Like that. I think I'm going to place the, uh, whoops, master bath to the right.
Okay, and I think that's all I'm gonna do in here. Build wise. If you want, you can also make this into a um, dresser. Alright, now we're gonna come into the master bathroom. And we're gonna make a couple of, uh, a few more things in here. Including a bathtub and a shower. Now I'm gonna call it quite sad, ladies and gentlemen. Let me show you how to make a little um, sour stall. They can make, they, they can get an animal crossing. these materials and we're going to grab white glazed terracotta again if you want you can use a different one I like white glazed I need buttons I need a uh, hook. Quartz block again. A cauldron. A quartz slab. Glass. Let me see if I got glass. Daylight sensor. A oak trap door and a lever. Oh, and uh, we'll see. Something to make lighting, and we'll use that. Alright. First thing we're gonna do is make a bathtub. This is gonna go right here. One, two, three, four, oh, four, five, one, two, three, four. Actually, I'm not gonna make it like perfect. I'll place it here. We'll uh, place that door here in a minute. Place a lever and a 
a toilet perfect and I'll place a sink right here oops and on the left and over here I'm gonna make a shower stall think of this like that I'm gonna place it like that. So a stall ready to go and last thing for I uh, finish everything we're gonna place 
two towels because this is a master bathroom. I'll say the door. And we go ladies and gentlemen we now have an entire we, we now have all the rooms that you can make so let's take a look all the rooms I so you how to make so this is what your entire rooms will look like once it, they are 100% fully completed. We have a bathroom. We have a kitchen. We have a bedroom. Tell bedroom, if you will. We have the dining room. The living room. It's a nice little cozy fireplace. A rec room slash den. And finally, the master bathroom. The master bedroom with a master bathroom. I hope you guys enjoyed my tutorials on all these. Um, I just figured that you guys would like to see what kind of designs you can do for all of these. And, uh, yeah. That was it, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, tomorrow or Sunday, I am planning on doing another build. I'm thinking maybe doing um starting on the other nooks cranny um tutorials. Like Nook and Go and Nooking Tens, Nook Way, all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. I'm gonna leave these here. Um, you can decorate your houses how you want. And oh, and also go we did the D A L Airport and all that. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed my tutorial on all of these builds. And uh, do keep a lookout. Because they got lots and lots of builds still left to come. And of course, if you want to check out my other builds, you can check the description down below. Or you can check out my playlist. Because I'll have those on there. And if you want to, you can go ahead to subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell. Make sure that you have all my videos to your sub box. And I will see you next time. And uh, thank you for watching, guys. I will see you tomorrow or Sunday because I have yet another build planned. See you guys tomorrow or Sunday.